What is going on everybody? This is Major League Pops. That's Pops with the Z. P-O-P-Z. Alright guys, I just thought it'd be a good opportunity to give you guys kind of an update where I am at with one of my particular sets that I've been working on. It was pretty much like the first set that I started working on. And if you guys are new to the channel, thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit your notifications so you get notified when I upload the next video. But the set that we are talking about, we are talking about the Avengers set. It was the first set that I started collecting and uh, I kind of fell for the Avengers set because uh, we went to watch the Avengers Endgame. Uh, and then we saw Avengers Infinity War, and they were just really good movies. So, you know, I thought it'd be cool to get the Avengers set. So I thought I'd wear my Thanos shirt right there. Uh, I'm not wearing the Thanos hat right now, but I have a Thanos hat in my collection. So that was really cool. Uh, but recently I was able to pick up a couple more Avengers. So I either have the set or I'm getting close to the set. I will tell you I am missing guaranteed one. I am missing Wong. It was the Walgreens SDCC exclusive. I haven't gotten that one yet. I'm going to probably have to go on eBay and order it from there, but that's okay. I, I feel like I got most of them, so we'll double check. But the first one that I want to show you, and it was the most recent one that I picked up, but we got, bam, rocket number 462 Rocket's just a cool little guy this was a walmart exclusive so i was actually really surprised to find it at walmart because at least here in windsor let me show you guys the back my walmart honestly does not carry anything so on the basic set there are a total of 11 and then they have a couple Walmart exclusives. They have a Walgreens exclusives, so on. So there's at least a total of 11 in the normal set. So Rocket, here you go. Finally got the Rocket. The next one that we got, and I can't remember honestly where I picked it up, but we got number 480 Rescue. This one is just, a, it's a nice little pop. It's a bobblehead. So nothing spectacular. I really love the design on the outfit. Just, it's very nicely done painted very well matches the character really good you know it matches her really nicely i just it's artistically it's very well done paint looks really good it's funny though on the back you know on the previous box they showed 11 and then on this one they show 14 so either i can't count or they keep increasing them yeah four four three so here you have 11 and then on this one uh, they have 14 so it's like they keep adding so here so here you go so this is number 480 rescue all right the next one that we got this one uh, i just waited for a minute to get it but it's a nice one but we got black widow number 454 just a really nice one they did a really good job with the black widow so she's i like how she has like her little i guess honestly i'm not really sure what she has in her hands i don't know what she calls them they almost look like Sticks, I guess, but they're not sticks. So you guys are probably gonna kill me. I like how they show her earrings. It looks like she's got three hooped earrings on. She's wearing her infinity suit, you know, the Avenger suit. So it looks really good in that gray, black, and red. So check out the detail on the Black Widow. Looks really good, looks really nice. Sorry about the glare. But yeah, I'm just super excited to get these ones. And the next one that we got, and it's almost kind of similar to Black Widow, but obviously it's not, but we got Captain Marvel number 459 looks really good. She has her hands out like that. She got her hair nice and flowing. Looks really good. The facial features are pretty basic. Doesn't look nothing special or anything, but I really like the paint job on the suit. It almost looks like a combination of like Spider-Man or Wonder Woman type deal. They did a really good job on the suit itself. So not too bad. I like it. I won't say it's one of my favorite ones, but I do like the overall details. The next one that I want to show you, of course, it's one of the favorite ones, of course, in the whole movie, but we got Thor number 452. He's got his hammer in his hand. He's got his Avenger suit on or the Infinity suit, black, red, gray. Looks really good. I like how they give him the details with the beard. So it also gives him a little like mouth in a sense, even though it's kind of weird that they have it like this. And I'll show you in just a second. He's got the little scar on his eye. So here's what I'm talking about the mouth. It just looks kind of funny. I understand what they're trying to do, but yeah right where his mouth should be i don't know maybe it should be another direction because uh not sure what's going on with that one so you know have to you know, a little marking on that one the other thing is his eyebrows are a different color from the rest of his hair you know so i i like the fact they tried to 
give him a beard. It's just, it looks kind of weird. I mean, I guess he's supposed to be like, mm, like that and then has the beard around. I, I guess that's kind of what it is, like a serious face, a uh, serious pose. So check out the side. So he's got his messed up eye right there all the way across. But the funny part is, is like, even though he kind of looks like he's supposed to have a messed up eye or a scratched cornea, on the actual figure itself, both his eyes are normal black, so they didn't really change the coloration on the eye to show that he had a, an injured eye like they do here on this side. So uh, the axe itself, like that part, I like the suit. Uh, details, they're not too bad, not too great, but not too bad. Next one that we have, this was another Walmart exclusive, but we got Ronin. And I was uh, happy to find this one as well. Like I said, my Walmart typically doesn't have nothing. So just to be able to find Ronin was actually really cool. I'm not honestly very familiar with Ronin. So check it out. Very nice. They did a really good job with the details. You know, with the suit for Ronin. And they got the sword, nice and gold, black suit details on there. So I don't know. Overall, really good details. Like I said, I'm not familiar with Ronin, so you guys will have to let me know. Obviously, I need to go watch the movie. I can't wait till the movie comes out in a couple of days on DVD. I am going to go pick it up. And the last one that I was able to pick up recently was Captain America. Just really nice one. Um, I like these Captain American ones. They just look really good. Uh, the one thing I know it's not normal per se uh, because of its outfit overall. I wish they would have matched his, his Captain America mask with his actual outfit with that gray, black, and red design. That would have been kind of cool. Yes, I do know that's not how the movie went or anything like that. But I just thought that would actually be a really cool like little... Thing that they would have did to it so otherwise than that uh, I wish they would have probably put a shield in his hand or something of that nature because you know he always has his Captain America shield or he at least has it on the back and of course there's nothing on the back overall though I think I'm finally getting close I know I need Wong I'm gonna see what else ones I need so you guys I hope overall though you guys did like my review on the Avengers pops if you guys haven't collected the Avenger pops I'd recommend getting them they're good pops like I said it was the first set that I started collecting so really happy that I started it and like I said I just maybe got to get Wong there we go uh, good ones, not bad. I would definitely pick them up if I was you. Still really good prices, still easy to find, so why not, right? Especially if you have all the other Avengers or superhero type pops, perfect pops right there. All right, you guys, hope you guys enjoyed my video. Please leave a thumbs up if you did. If you ever want to follow me on social media, you can always do that at Major League Hats with the Z, and I'll provide the link there at the bottom. All right, you guys, thanks for watching. This is Major League Pops out. Bye, everybody. See ya.